everyone, it's Graham Coleman with Daily Extra, and we're here on the red carpet premiere of Foxcatcher, which is based on a true story and stars Steve Carell, Channing Tatum, and Mark Ruffalo. Hi. Do you have any idea who I am? I don't choose to do something in order to elicit a, a response. What do you hope to achieve? I didn't do it in order to prove anything to anybody. I was an actor trying out a role and being a part of, you know, a, a different world for a little while. And I want to see this country soar again. I didn't want somebody who is known for doing something like what this character does. You know, the people who knew this character, it's based on a true story, the people who knew this character did not expect that he could do what he did. Similarly, I don't think you're expecting that Steve Carell is able to play a character that could do what this character does. I also happen to think that he's, you know, a great actor, and, uh, and I think the comedic actors have some special kind of edge. You know, they always have some kind of hidden darkness and sharpness that uh, you, you rarely see. There's a lot of speculation as to whether or not John DuPont was a suppressed gay man. What's your take on this and was it relevant to the film? You know, I've been, I've been getting this question uh, here and there lately. It's like, was he, wasn't he? And I just think it's, I think it's a lot more complex than that. I think sexuality is more complex. And I, I, I think what happened down there um, is how it's depicted in the film. Is that There is something that's, you know, in the atmosphere that's charged, but that never quite surfaces, it never becomes explicit. But I, I would be hesitant to try to explain him with a label. That's it for the red carpet of Foxcatcher. Keep watching Daily Extra for more TIFF coverage.